good evening wherever you are on this uh, most pleasant evening. There has been a clamour to get inside the ground tonight for a much-anticipated game. The uh, roads outside of the stadium have been bumper to bumper with traffic. The car parks are full. There is a torrent of humankind making its way from the nearby station and we expect every seat to be filled. An atmosphere of uh, great expectation and excitement. The stands here, the Corva, as the locals call them, make for quite an impressive sight, all in support of the grand old lady of the Italian game. We have already started here. Jim, what do you think when you see Beckham? Whistle's gone, that's a foul. Bentancourt is being told in no uncertain terms that this will be his final warning. He just needs to find the control button on his aggression. He's gone for it! <laughs> and he just whacks it away. He's gone for it! Goal! What a start, and what a contribution from the main man. I had a feeling he might do something, given his reputation, but to do it like that, absolutely brilliant. I wasn't expecting that. I can give the keeper a little sympathy here because I think he might have been slightly unsighted. However, credit where it's due, it's still a fine finish from a tight spot. A quite dramatic opening, an early turn of the unexpected. This is quite a run, and he's not done yet. Here's the delivery. Massive leap! Good delivery, no joy. I have to commend the wing plate, but I have to condemn... Oh, give it away! Got the ball glued to his feet. Just brushed off the ball there. Well, the crowd clearly liked what they just saw. Some real no-nonsense defending. And he's made sure that that won't get through. So, does he stay or does he go? That's the question on everyone's lips. Where the manager's contract is concerned. Yeah, he'll have no problems dealing with his situation, but he has to be careful that his players don't use the uncertainty as an excuse. Mohamed Salah tries... Yeah, he's fouled him there. Now it's Aubameyang. Oh, that had to be more accurate. Salah. Beckham is fouled. Marcelo gets his final warning. Well, he knew what he was taking on there, Peter, and special delivery from the ref. Uh, let down by a lack of accuracy. Origi. Mohamed Salah. Salah. There he goes, motoring forward. And it's Messi. And here's Mohamed Salah. Mohamed Salah! That carried quite a threat. Lampard. And it's played forward. It's all a little short of forward momentum, lacking thrust. And here's Origi. That's great strength on the ball. Now it's Neymar. Messi. Messi goes looking. Aubameyang. Rincon. Beckham. Messi plays a clever pass. That has put a stop to that. Chiellini.
And it's Neymar. James Rodriguez. And they've got it back as soon as they gave it away. James looks to clip it forward. And it's hoisted clear. Tried to play it through. Uh, it was too timid to make it through the defence. It'll be noted and, and improved upon, I'm sure. And there's a long ball. Ball through needs to be good here. Mohamed Salah going for goal! Cesc Fabregas hoists it forward. And it's Lampard. Keeps everyone guessing. Now it's Mohamed Salah. A real chance to break. And that's the end of that. It all started well enough. Finds himself eased off the ball. For a moment you felt that was going somewhere, but they'll have to go again. Is there any tries of shots? No messing about, just bludgeoned away. And the first half is done. So there you have it, a close sport half of football. But God, it still had its moments, but ultimately produced just one goal. A more than decent game up to now. It's a dressing room that needs rousing at half-time because, in truth, they've not really been at it so far. Um, if the pep talk works, we may see a very different side second half. We need to. Here we go again. Juventus don't need to press the panic button just yet. They may have to tweak their, their setup first if they don't grab an early goal in this second half. They can't hold back, though. And Dyke is there to heave it away. Promising move, that. Good inroads into enemy territory, but no joy. Questions were asked, but he's given the answers. And no, that is pretty much the end of that. Rincon. James Rodriguez. Messi. Oh, well intercepted, really alert to the danger. James. And here's Aubameyang. And he's looking at the referee, but the referee is shaking his head. Salah. And here's Cristiano Ronaldo. Neymar. Oh, that is lovely footwork. It's a fabulous position. And he's there to cut it out. Forward it goes. Could move up a gear here. And it's Aubameyang. Good ball. Now it's Aubameyang. And Aubameyang! Sticks it away! A two-goal lead, and they're firmly in control. Mohamed Salah was quick to move in. Keeper's handling wasn't great. I doubt he'll score too many, which come easier than that, Peter, but just look at his movement. He knew instinctively that the keeper would struggle to hold on to it. Juventus down by two, and the shot is on. Played into the middle. That intervention was very necessary. Van Dijk gets it upfield. Mohamed Salah tries to stroke it through. Sergio Ramos. Sergio Ramos plays it forward. Good take by the keeper, he's read that well. Try 
Needs to get it forward quickly. Right through the middle. Now it's Aubameyang. Aubameyang! Oh, that was nice, but not quite the end product required. Aubameyang certainly did his part with a lovely pass, and unfortunately, the loveliness ceased there. And here's Mohamed Salah. Rincon. Mohamed Salah. Mohamed Salah conjuring up some magic on the right-hand side. Cleared without complication. He's through. Mohamed Salah. And the shot! James Rodriguez. Hoists it forward. It's a long ball, but it's not hit its target. Cesc Fabregas. What an adventurous run from a defender. Towering header! And in it goes! And they are dragging it back! Game on again! Well, you know, thinking about that, I think they've perfected that on the training ground because it took them seconds to get the ball from back to front and they really commit forward in numbers too. It was all very well drilled. Juventus get themselves back into contention. I think they've done so well to get back in it, but it's important now that they don't become over-eager in chasing another. They only need one more chance. Patience is key. Now it's James Rodriguez. Gets the better of his man. This is good ball retention, and it should be enough from here, but they want to double their advantage. Gorgeous control there. Lampard. Great leap! He will be livid with himself. Moments left, barely that, to avoid a shock defeat now. Is that a foul? Yes, the uh, referee's given it. Now it's Beckham, and it's Salah. He's tried one! Oh, good effort, he got plenty on that. Yeah, the shot was enabled, Peter, due to such smart control and technique. Bentancur. Played into space out wide. Salah. Gets it back. And that will be the final act. Juventus lose by the odd goal. It could have gone either way, but that is no consolation. So, Jim, how do you reflect on what we've seen? Juventus seem to have taken this on with a, a complacent mentality to just turn up and win, and they deserve the criticism they're going to get. Many thanks to Jim, and with that, it is a very good night to you.